The moment a glass panel shatters inside an elevator because one man made a mistake. Welcome to the latest on Facebook Watch. I'm Angela Cox, in for Michael Usher. Let's take a closer look at this disastrous video. Security pictures from inside the lift show two men carrying a large panel of glass. One man holds his hand against the door in order to keep it open until the panel is safely in. For some unknown reason, he bends down, taking his hand away from the lift. The doors close onto the sheet of glass. Panicked, he tries to open them first with his hands, then by pushing a button. He fails. The safety sensors on the doors don't work and the elevator descends with the panel wedged in its doors. The glass hits the ceiling, dust comes down, then shatters all over both men, leaving them staring in disbelief at the shards that surround them. The incident happened in Vietnam. No word yet whether these poor guys have been trusted moving anything again. Now take a look at this. This video shows a teenage boy who has just broken into a house. He enters a living room down a set of stairs. He turns on a light. It's bright and scares him. The time is 2.40 a.m. He makes his way to another room and spots someone asleep on the lounge. That person is 15-year-old Anaya Robinson. The video shows the boy, a 14-year-old intruder, creepily standing over the girl for some time. The video ends there, but she wakes up and sees a stranger standing over her. The boy ran off after stealing some tools. Kansas police say he has a track record of similar crimes and will be charged over the break-in. Now, this video is heart-stopping. As children's playgrounds are closed around the world due to the pandemic, one father has taken it upon himself to build his own playground. Problem is, he lives in an apartment and it's 25 metres above ground. Filmed by a journalist in Puerto Rico and posted to Reddit, this video shows the dad pushing his toddler on his homemade swing on the balcony. Repeatedly, he pushes the child higher and higher. Despite the balcony being on the eighth floor, the toddler doesn't appear to be secured with any safety equipment. Those who saw the video slam the man for risking his child's life. Just because you can't go to the park does not mean you can risk your child's life, said one. Others pointed out that dad could have installed the swing inside the flat. We understand the parenting during a pandemic can be trying, but maybe rethink the balcony swing set. Thanks for watching. I'm Angela Cox.